for the serious gamer. Well, hey, hey there, people. It's Guns for Hire from Next Gen Tactics. This is a, yes, a special episode of the Gun Shop. Normally, I don't do two in one day. But this idea, I just couldn't, I couldn't help it. It came to me like a brainstorm. It hit me like a, like a fat person's ass wrestling, you know, where you just can't breathe and they're just, they don't have no skill, but they're crushing you and they, I just got to get it out or I can't breathe, right? Oh, I'm sorry. Did I offend some of you guys? Like, are you ever friended me? I swear to God, if I ever get out of my chair and find you, I'm going to eat you alive. I'm just messing with you. Relax. Relax, man. I mean, my sister's fat. My mom's fat. I still love them. Don't worry. Lots of hugs for you. I just got to open my arms a little wider for you. <laughs> Again, I'm kidding. Relax. Whoa, you guys are like crazy. Anyway, I've decided, and this is kind of going in line with what I thought of. Anyway, first of all, uh, if you haven't seen it, episode 10, the real episode, I mean the real gun shop that I like, oh, do all the preparations for, and like, okay, what am I going to talk about, uh, is on the website right now. Yes. I mean, obviously, you can probably see it. If you haven't, links in the uh, description of this video, you can watch it. Yeah, that's right. Go watch it. Anyway, um, and it's called PlayStation 3 is Superior to Xbox and uh, a special message to only use me blade fanboys yes a special 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 message for you yeah so watch that and it kind of goes in line with what i was going to say i've decided out of this you know this whole crazy controversy that happened and exploded and it was like whoa i mean i think at one point i believe that spider bite was a little nervous about it. he's like oh dude dude this is not what we need i'm like this is exactly what we need by the way, Spider Bite is completely out of this in terms of, you know, here's usually what it is. He jokes around, has fun. You, if you've seen his videos, he's always joking around. He has fun and everything like that. But he knows where the line is, and he doesn't usually cross it. Whereas I identify the line, and I don't like being on this side of the line. So I look at the line. I don't just put my toe across or, you know, like lean over the line. I like jump over the damn line, and I'm over there where I shouldn't be. Because it's funny, it amuses me, and it causes people to freak out like it did. You guys came out of the woodwork, but it was awesome. I mean, yeah, and granted, fans, fans, NGT fans and my fans, both, mixture, whatever, don't even worry about it. Listen, most of you guys will be watching this, okay? Now, when you do watch this, just know that I'm going to be purposely stirring the pot. Not like every single time, but periodically. So don't get all crazed up. Actually feed into it. I want you guys to actually help me. Help me design the perfect ticking bomb. We're going to pull in so many uh, crazy, weak-minded, delicate little flowered fools out there. The same ones that threw all the insults and everything on there. I mean, I did actually respond to some of them. I was like, oh, you know, that's very nice. Thanks for the kind words. My favorite color is green. What is yours? Uh, you know, and I just want to give them a big hug. Big hug. There's so much anger in them. They don't get it. That's what I do. I cause controversy. And now I've I've decided that it's kind of a not a war because there's no really one person to attack, but let's let's play a game where every episode of the gun shop that I show, you guys give me feedback. You guys give me feedback of how I can stir the pot up. And we're going to work and I'm talking about, you know, all the fans of the subscribers on our website. Because I won't, I don't usually pay attention to half the the comments. I mean, if if they're on YouTube, yes, you know, whatever, I'll respond uh, to a couple of them. But generally, you know, I expect trolls and haters, so I ignore it. If you want me to respond, if you want me to really take what you're saying seriously, that's the website, and that's where I sort of pay attention because that's my home. But anyway, I want you guys after every episode, in all honesty, and I think it'll be fun. It'll be like you and me creating this crazy catastrophe this bomb waiting to happen and we'll have so much freaking fun i promise you i promise you but you can't get so offended don't get so offended even if you're offended by this stuff and you are fans of ngt uh and then you left or whatever because you got all offended dude that's what i do you gotta seriously i said it before i'll say it again strap on a pair okay this isn't like mr dress up when i'm not going to show you how to make a a paper crown and everything and we'll play prince and princess okay that's not what happens here but i'm going to purposely create chaos i'm going to be the chaos master and you're going to help me so give me ideas like i mean obviously i'm not going to offend certain groups um you know i don't want to be crossing the line having people burn down my house or anything if they could find me i live in a castle by the way in norway yeah anyway 
So give me ideas. We're going to we're going to launch this. And you know what? Granted, most of the people out there, this they're not going to be watching this. Some of them will get catch wind of this and they'll put their comments on YouTube and they'll say, "You're a douchebag blah 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 blah." And I know some of you say, "Don't use that word all the time." Who cares? What do you Seriously, if you're offended by that, stop watching the show. Stop putting little pussy ass comments on here about how you I use the word douchebag and uh, vagina too much. Vagina. Okay? You're offended by that. Seriously, dude. Come on. I know maybe your mom's in the background going, oh, little Johnny, you got to turn that off. Don't watch it when your mom's in the room. Think about it. Anyway, let's cause chaos together. Together. I'm still going to do gunshot, but wouldn't it be fun to do a gunshot maybe every other day? And then in between, you know, maybe once or twice, we create a gunshot that causes explosions and offends people and gets them all crazed up. And of course... I do it because I love the chaos. I love the chaos, dudes. Positive or negative, I don't really care. These people talking about my life, they don't affect me. They don't offend me. And when I did, you know, like my apology to only use my blade, it was an apology only to him. I mean, all the other little fan bots and everything that I offended. Dude, seriously, you really think I care? Come on. I actually loved it. I loved that the fact that they got all angry because they juiced up my views like nutso. So why not? And I thought, you know what? Let's do that. Let's see how big of a bomb we can create without really causing too much problem. It's just all we're going to be doing. So granted, think about it this way. Think of things that people take or gamers that take seriously. Even the ones that are like, this is just a game. You went way overboard. You have offended people. Dude, why, why don't you calm down? You're such a app and boop, beep, beep, and loser. You know what I mean? Who really cares? Those guys are weak-minded fools too. Yeah. If you're watching this. Dude, seriously, if you were a flower, like uh, I went to a big garden and everything, like all these flowers, you'd be a pansy. Yeah, delicate little pansy. Listen, the show isn't about how to throw tea parties and stuff. I've said that before, all right? I'm not showing you how to be Princess Barbie. We talk about stuff. We talk about games, and I offend people. It's what happens. But I do it just because it's funny, okay? If any of you don't know uh, Andrew Dice Clay, that's what, you know, I... Found that guy funny. He offended a crap load of people, but he became super popular. I don't care. I'll be that dude. And I'll do it for you guys. So all my fans and NGT fans, let's create some chaos. Together, you and me, we'll go out there, sprinkle our disgusting, putrid, filthy poison on people and see them squirm and scream and yell. Yeah, you offended me. I'm going to kill you. <laughs> Seriously? It's funny stuff, man. Trust me. And when they make comments, don't get all caught up in it. Don't don't respond to them by saying, you know, oh, yeah, you don't even know. You don't know. Guns is legitimate. Don't even do that. Dude, feed into it. Be like, you know what? I totally agree. Guns has a small penis, and he deserves to be lynch mobbed. You know what I mean? Feed it. Feed the fury and, and stuff like that. Or give them crazy responses like, you know what? I agree with you, but I really like ponies better. You know what I mean? Make them go, what? What are you talking about? All your fans are freaking retards <laughs> it'd be just funny stuff man trust me you put crazy comments down respond to the every single one every single hate comment that's on there respond with something crazy or i love you i'm gonna give you a hug this is a hug for uh from guns for hire through me to you i love you and just freak them all out they'll get so crazy offended it'll they'll blow up you'll hear little brains popping all over america canada and the world because they won't know what's going on come on let's cause chaos together Give me some ideas. Let's do this. I love it. Chaos. Video game news, opinions once in a while, and then chaos slipped in the, to, you know, tenderize and simmer and cause some seasoning. Fiesta. Peace.